YouTubers, Mike Martin's here, Mike Martin's channel. I'm getting a lot of uh, replies to my video, Australia's Diarrhea Housing Market. And I was comparing uh, bad sectors in the, the housing market here. I'll show you guys here real quick what I'm trying to talk about. Basically, you could buy four of these houses in Florida, for the, or three of these houses in Florida for the price of one house that's sold in Australia. So I have somebody here uh in the comments that said this should this should be renamed mike martin's mr real estate opportunity channel grapes uh, uh grapes anyone so uh sour grapes anyone so basically uh that is a very good question he's asking here so i pinned it to the top and he goes into other things here which is really interesting um i pinned that to the top because i did not miss the real estate thing i don't care about real estate People need to understand there's different ways and avenues to make income. You don't need to have a house for um, an ATM machine to, 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 to make it in, in uh, financially or to make it um, well in life. You know, what I mean? I'm just trying to put this into proper perspective. I bought my house. I bought my home. And then uh, I just bought it outright from the down payment I saved to buy in Vancouver. I realized that I wasn't getting enough bang for my buck where I lived in the city, and uh, did I move? Real, did I uh, miss the real estate opportunity? Of course, I did, but I don't care. Uh, a majority of my my streams of income have nothing to do with real estate. Period. I'm just not a fan of having to. Um, I'm not a fan of getting into uh, 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 renting out units and then dealing with uh, with tenants and then having to deal with that and then then having to get a, a lawyer to offset the income so you don't like capital gains and stuff. It's just so much. It's not worth it. There's so many other ways and different other ways to stream in income. So basically, and then this guy basically goes, you mean the kind the, the third world country is okay? You overprivileged kitty lover you. And then he just, just trashing me. Um, just trashing me in the comments. I don't know why. And just nonstop. He's probably from Australia or something because he's using specific words or specific grammars that they do use in Australia. Guys, I, I, I'm not into the whole housing market too. I'm into the house, talking about the housing market to make it affordable so that, that you don't have to make, uh, it's not 26 times your income to uh, be able to afford a house. That's it. That's all it is. That's all I'm talking about. If you guys, I mean, we could talk about the stocks, my holdings, what I'm looking at, the incredible uh, returns I made during the 2011 up to 2013 in oil and dividends and stuff that I did. Like, we, I could get into actually, like, let's make money type of thing. Let's look here. I'm opened a small business. Now I'm catering online. I'm doing this. You know, I have other things on the... I don't have to worry about real estate house. My house is paid for. I don't have to worry about making payments on it. All I have to do is pony up the property tax. Ever since I bought my house free and clear with no mortgage payment now, uh, the house went up to three forty. I bought it for two sixty. I'm getting my assessment next week, and they're saying it's roughly three forty because I went to City Hall to ask uh, when are we getting our our property taxes because I just want to pay it off, right? So. It's really interesting the, the amount of disposable income you have when you own your house. And I just wish people could see that freedom they could have instead of buying into 100% financed homes. People that I got in 100% finance. Yeah, so just the hate out there is just incredible. Like, you could just keep it uh, very professional, you know. Hang on, looks like uh, Germander, I don't know, Gerald's deleted his posts, uh, gutless, at least... He likes kids. Like this is this is really 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 sour. Uh, I don't mind people um, testing me or, or or actually discussing what I was discussing. Do you want to buy three of these homes or one two bedroom home in Australia? Like, so I was comparing this this cottage that was sold for one point three million. In comparison, would you rather buy three of these homes, four or five bedroom homes? Would you rather have these F three or four of these? Or would you rather have, sorry, just back here, this one cottage? Like, so that's not the cottage, sorry, that. That's all the video was about. And I don't understand why there's so much hatred. If you are right and I am wrong, then that's that, that's fine. I, I don't mind being wrong. But, 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 but being ridiculed and made fun of um, 
is is really low. Just tell me what what, what why you are so uh, mad with me. I I don't understand and why people need to make accounts. Like I don't know why people don't just come on as themselves and just say, "Hey, Mike, I think you're completely wrong. Yes, you missed a boat, and I missed a boat for a reason. And and I want to raise a family and have kids. I don't care about owning real estate." To make money off. I don't want to make money off real estate. There's so many ways. There's a sea of money to be made out there. The more dumb the people are, the more um, um, ignorant people become, the more money there is to be made out there. Believe me. And it's not manipulating people. It's just understanding the markets, understanding the equity markets, uh, following currency and tracking and uh, following gold, hedging against inflation. Uh, different ways uh, to 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 diversify your portfolio and your stuff, but c making making this um, these kind of comments on here is it, it's just just man up and be make proper comments like just just get to the point and uh, and explain why I'm wrong. You know what I'm saying? No one's ever explained with this Australia diarrhea housing crisis why I'm wrong. Why am I wrong? Did I miss the gravy train? Uh, I probably did, but I don't care. Do you think when I die, I'm taking my house with me when I die? I'm not. I'm taking my memories. I'm taking what I've made on this earth thought-wise and the good times I've had with me to the next world. I'm not taking any of my house, my business, or whatever. My main focus is family and raising a proper family and 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 loving my family and being there for my family and i want people to to see my point of view as delusional as i might seem at times or or idiotic and undereducated i am i need people just to be professional in the comment section do you know what i'm saying i don't want to ban people from my channel i don't want to delete comments off my channel i want people to be able to express what they want to say but don't bring up crap that's that has nothing to do with what we're talking about here you know what I'm saying? Let me know. Australia's diarrhea housing market. I'll leave a link below to the video so you can see it in its entirety. It is ruffling a, a few people's feathers. But what? why you... If I wanted to enter into the housing market right now, let's say I wanted to enter into the real estate market to make money. I would go to this place here. I spoke to the builder on the phone for permission to of this, these homes. So... Been through hurricanes. It's winding... It's winding... I would buy three of those. Why would I buy one one bungalow when I could buy three of those homes for the same price? That's what I'm getting at. If I wanted to invest in housing, real estate, or get into the real estate, I would just buy three of those. Why would I buy one? You get what I'm saying? I don't know, guys. I just need to know. Let me know what you guys think.